Hello and welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make Minecraft custom live stream scenes. All you need for this tutorial is OBS Studio and Flashback Mod. So once you've launched Minecraft, go into a single player world. I choose this spot right here. You got to press start recording and then just do whatever you want in your scene. Once you're done, just press finish recording, save replay, save and quit the title. Go over here to the flashback icon and just load up your replay. Once you've loaded in, I usually go to options and go to FOV 30. Then I press play and see wherever I want my player to end up in. You can use the center guide or the rule of thirds guy to help you put in the center what i did in this scene is that i put my camera in a way that at the start you can see the player but then he comes in frame and then leaves that way the video can loop and make for a good live stream scene then i just add element put a camera and then go all the way to the end and put a camera again then what i do is press here to render sky and turn it off and then go over here to render name tags and turn it off as well and also if you see something in the background like this that you don't want you can just go over here to override fog and then mess with the end slider until it isn't there anymore then go over here to export video and then copy my settings transparent sky mov and then quick time this way the video will turn out with a transparent background and then just press start export now go over to whatever editing software you want i'm gonna use CapCut, and then just drag your footage in after that you're gonna go make a background for this i'm gonna use photo p which is a free photoshop just go over here to new project select 1920 by 1080 and then create then choose whatever background you want i'm just gonna use a solid color and pin bucket in then you're gonna add some text for whatever scene you want i'm gonna choose be right back so you're just gonna style it however you want to okay mine is done then just go over here to file export as png and save then just drag the background in put it behind the video and drag it all the way to the end so it covers the whole video and that's basically it that's how i did my live stream scene then just export the video make sure to copy these settings and just press export then go over to obs add a scene then add a source and go over to media source go to browse and find your video press loop and then set okay then just grab it and crop it however you want to so i'm just gonna make this fit the whole screen and that's basically it now you have a custom minecraft live stream scene thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next video